Hey everyone, and welcome back to episode 14 of Slime Rancher. The last episode came back to the moss blanket and the apiaries. All the apiaries. Um, I got a ton of wild honey and buzzwax. I had three apiaries, which, uh, hold on, do I? I made three, right? No, 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 excuse me. I made five at the end of the last episode. So I have five more apiaries to throw down here, which of course I'm going to do. And I think now that I have used an apiary for the first time, I'm probably going to get myself an advanced one today. So last time I made an advanced drill, I unlocked the advanced pump. I unlocked like all, all like the like the newer, like the up the upper tier of these things. I also unlocked a uh, a couple of recipes that I can't wait to start using, but they require materials that I don't have access to yet. So that's gonna that's gonna be a little while. But uh, that's the plan anyway. Uh. Are you okay? I, uh, you, 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 little buddy. <laughs> Here, I'm gonna help that briar chick out. He, he appears to be having a bad day. But, um, <laughs> if you guys are enjoying the Slime Rancher videos, I do appreciate it. if you take a moment to like the video. It does help out and it does mean a lot. And thank you guys for that support. But I've been really focused on getting the slime science thing going. And, trying to tech up and trying to unlock some things and to make sure that like everything's being used and utilized and I'm not wasting any time. So now that I have all of those back down, I still have a pump. I think, hold on, let me see here. Let me find another one of these spots. Is there another one of these spots over here? No, I still, I still have a, I have, I have some pumps I need to put down. Um, which means I need to go back to the indigo. Oh, I'm sorry, not pumps. I keep, I keep mixing them up. Okay. Uh, the drills. I have some drills I need to go put down in the indigo quarry. That is the current plan to go get some more materials, and I guess um, I'll put them closer to the teleport. That just makes sense to me. But uh, I started feeding my pink rock slimes, my pink rock gordo, or I'm sorry, largos. The Heartbeats, so I have doubled the production of pink plorts, which I'm still gonna add, I think, some more pink slimes here in the future. And then I have also started feeding the rad hunter ones, Oka Oka, which is another favorite of theirs, so I've also doubled that production. Essentially, I am mass producing my plorts now, just by changing the food. So here is my first ever advanced object. An advanced drill that lasts three cycles and has a higher chance for rare resources. Just to see if that looks like any any sort of fancier. I think it does. It's been a little bit since I've seen one of the normal drills. But uh, that appears to be a bit more fancy. Uh, Casey also sent me a message at the end of the last episode. So I need to go back home and read that thing. Let's put this here. So you can see there's the, the advanced one over there and the novice one. You know what? I'm a level with you. They kind of... <laughs> they kind of look the same, but it doesn't matter as long as they produce the better material the, the better resources I, I'm perfectly fine with that. So we have three drills running over here We have five apiaries down and I don't have any Pumps currently right? I don't think I have any pumps currently down um, I'm gonna put four in there. I don't put any more so that means I need to start making some pumps because I need to get those materials. I do have access to one of the hydro cannons and I will probably be making use of that. I think in, I could do it in the overgrowth, but I think for now, because this is where I'm most invested, I think I'm gonna put it in the main part of the ranch because we previously did have tar. I think it was specifically because of the boom slimes, but um, it, it doesn't change anything. There were there were tar in here, and <laughs> that's the last thing I need to do is face an outbreak of tar and rip all my slimes, because that would require a little bit of traveling back and forth to, get, you know, to replenish the stocks. Oh my god, I was hearing, I was hearing noises from that, that, uh, that music box, and I thought there was a tar sneaking up on me. Now I'm, now I'm paranoid. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Let me sell these plorts. I need to go turn in this honey. But uh, let me sell these let me sell these plorts for now. Um I need to pick up I need to pick up the pink ones too, obviously. There's so much to do. Gotta do my rounds, man. Gotta do my rounds. Um let's check to see the amount that they've produced. Wow. Wow. That's that's honestly that's kind of impressive just how much they've produced because we've changed over their food source. That's so good. That's 56 
pink plorts in here now. And I really don't have that many. You know, like, I don't have that many pink slimes. It's purely because of the food that I feed. God, that was such a, that was such a good change. I'm so happy about that. Um, there's probably some fruit on the ground. Yeah, right there. It needs some, needs some love. But I gotta drop my resources off here. So this is the first time introducing wild honey and buzzwax into my refinery. That, those are my first apiaries I've ever harvested. Yay! <laughs> and I've got some money to spend. About 9k for blueprints. Um, you know what? I'm gonna buy the Gordo Snare for now, even though I probably really can't make it. Uh, I'm gonna get the pink teleporter. A set of two teleporters that can be used to create your own quick travel link. I have no clue if that is... A permanent thing or a temporary thing nonetheless I'm gonna unlock it and we can always just check to see you know, like what I need for it but uh, I'm not gonna make a novice ape here I have a feeling that once another day passes or I sleep that we're going to unlock an intermediate one or I'm sorry an advanced one not, not an intermediate one now utility safe so here's a gordo snare hunter plort which apparently I don't have many many stored in here primordial oil which I'm getting when I do pumps Buzzwax from my apiaries, and Jellystone, I think, is the rare material from the Indigo Quarry. I can almost make a Gordo Snare. Almost. Uh, this thing uses a strange diamond, a hexacomb, and that might be a rare material right there. Never seen that one. So I'm guessing that's coming from an apiary, but I have no idea where a strange diamond... Maybe Glass Desert? I have no idea where that would come from. Uh, anyway, let's look, let's look into these things. So, Advanced Pump. I need to start storing some more Boom Plorts. But I can make two of these. I'm going to make two advanced pumps and go chuck those down to start pulling in some materials. But in the meantime, let me do my rounds here. I guess I could also just put a uh, pump right here, couldn't I? You know, this is technically the dry reef. <laughs> it's technically the dry reef. But you know what? It's not like it hurts me to put it right out front of my my my, uh, my little base or whatever we're going to call it. My my hamlet, if you will. Ah, ah, some gold star people will get what I'm saying here. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it's not really going to hurt anything. It's right here anyway, so I'm going to put it where I know it's going to work. Now, I just don't have to worry about anything. But let's pick up our Oak Okas and pick up our Heartbeats, which, by the way, we have doubled the Heartbeat production. So we're pulling in quite a few more Heartbeats every time, which is good because we weren't previously using Heartbeats, meaning we're living off of an old supply that we have just built up. Uh, which is not going to last forever unless I replenish it. So 15, 15. So we're only getting, we're only getting 30 here. Uh, I'm hoping this is enough to keep up with the, uh, the mix. I need to go visit the chickens. That's right. I gotta, I gotta go visit the chickens. Chickens. They probably need some TLC. Now heartbeats. How many do you guys have? You have enough stored. Good. Wee. <laughs> he said wee. 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 <laughs> Other noises. Wee. Oh, uh, have you not eaten more? Have you been just maybe focusing on some chickens? I feel like I could introduce more to the mix here. These guys have become incredibly docile ever since I, uh, I put that music box in there. So I think maybe next time I go to the Indigo Quarry, I might pick up some rad slimes and store them here. I think that might be a worthwhile investment. Uh, this is putting a lot of Oka Oka in there for them, but I have nothing, <laughs> nothing else to do with it right now. Rad ports in the refinery. I'm not certain how many I have, but you know what? I'm gonna pick up that and use that for money. When it comes to the hunter ports, however, now seeing as I I realize that I need them for a specific recipe, I think I'm gonna turn those in. I mean, gr granted, I'm always producing them, obviously, but I think I'm gonna go turn them in. Now, mint mangoes. I do need some more mint mangoes, and remember, we increase the number of mint mangoes being consumed by quite a bit. I'm adding like four or five tabbies last time. Uh, here you go, guys. Y'all just uh, just eat up. <laughs> How are you doing on Q-berries, little, little dudes? Let's go back to slow speed for you. I don't want to overfeed you. I don't want to underfeed you, but I don't want to overfeed you. Uh, these rad plorts, I, I guess I'll sell. And then I'll... No, no, no. You know what? Let's just go bank them both. I think that's a smart call. Bank them both just to make sure, make sure we're safe. Swing by, I'll get my onions, my carrots, and I'll store them, and I'll check my chickens. And then it's, uh... Well, I guess I should first put my pumps down. I'm gonna go put those pumps down. And the apiaries are gonna be ready on day 16. 
that one pump isn't going to be ready until like day... Ooh, day 17, remember, because I put down the advanced pump. So I'm going to have to start... I I'm trying to completely phase out the old uh, novice ones. And then I'm going up to the advanced ones. I gotta, I gotta remember, I gotta make that transition. There's three whole days I gotta wait versus the singular day. So that's entirely different. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm attempting to keep like a mental note of, you know, like when I have harvested or when I have placed some things down. So that way I, I don't really waste too much time going back and forth. Oh, I gotta get my hot onions. I don't, I don't, I don't want to obviously go back there and be like, oh, hey, well, that thing's not quite ready yet. Well, yeah, if, if, if I can avoid it using the power of my, my mighty pea brain. Uh, I'd prefer to do it, and I realize I'm taking a long way, a long, long, long way into the Indigo Quarry every time, and I still have this key, but I specifically saved this key because I have no idea what I'm going to expect once I go over to the Glass Desert. I don't know if I'm going to need another key, and under I really don't want to go there and realize that, hey, you need a key, and I I can't continue to explore the new area. I feel, I feel pretty bad about that. Uh, I think I did give you guys plenty of oak. Oh my god, he just did like a somersault. But I think I gave you guys plenty of oak oak, but I gotta store the stuff and go pick up the other things. Here I am, just storing odd onions. <laughs> um, and was it like a crystal slime? Uh, F1. Wasn't there... Let's see here, resources, odd onions. Doesn't tell me... Fa yeah, favored by crystal slime. I gotta go get those crystal slimes, man, so I can feed them. Because that's a whole nother port that I'm not even getting, you know? A whole nother port category. Shooey, man. Shooey. Oh my goodness, the mint mango problem persists. <laughs> hey, you guys want some mint mangoes? I got some mint mangoes for you. And you get a car, and you get a car. You're all getting cars. Now enjoy paying the tax on that. Oh my monies. Oh my monies! Anywho, let's see here. Roosters, elder roosters, yet? Yeah. They've only produced a few chickens. They haven't really been as busy as I would have expected. I'm gonna level with you. There's not that many chickens in here. Uh, okay then. That's actually kind of good because, I mean, I'm not really using them right now. There's just one less thing that I have to specifically go out of my way to keep track of. I guess I'll harvest these dudes. We can always launch them into the uh, <laughs> into the cage because they're they're not gonna disappear like fruit or yeah food food would. But you know what? Now that I have the money, let's see here. How much is this? Five thousand. The docks. Deep deep down in the great blue sea, I saw a thousand sm slimes smiling back at me. I'm gonna purchase this because I have a surplus of money at the moment, and I'm making tons of it like constantly. So oh really? Oh my god. Wait, is, that a, is that a rubber ducky? <laughs> it squeaks! <laughs> Hold on, if I... Okay, I was wondering if I hit the wall with it, would it just keep squeaking? <laughs> There's a rubber ducky! That is amazing! Hold on, I gotta hit the water. Oh, it doesn't squeak when you hit it with the water. Ooh, advanced apiary! There it is, an apiary that collects more, resor uh, more resources with a higher chance for rare resources. Yes! Advanced apiary unlocked. Four more plots unlocked. A rubber ducky. Um, it's a slime toy. Now, I don't know how slime toys work. Apparently that rubber band ball thing that I found a long time ago in the, uh, the moss blanket was a tabby slime toy. And I've never given that to them. So I may I might have to go bring that back here and just see what that does. But a rubber ducky, I don't know what slime prefers that one. Maybe the pu I happen to have puddle slimes. If that goes to the puddle slime, that's gonna be awesome. That is gonna be amazing. Is this just a uh, is this just a ranch expansion, not like a like a fancy area? Because if this is purely an expansion, that that solves some issues with like. Maybe I could move chickens over here instead, and then we could we could do free range over. It, possibilities, possibilities. Anyway, a view of the sea reminds you of our greater purpose. Uh, greater purpose, Beatrix. The sea was the first great unknown, and then space, and then whatever's beyond all that. That need to see what's around the next corner is in my bones, and since you're out here, I reckon it's in yours too. Though I suppose you could also be out here because you like the fresh air, or you prefer the untamed beauty of this land, or maybe because you're looking to leave something far behind you. Sure is the way to do it, doesn't get much farther than this. H. That is it. Uh, this appears to be 
purely, from what I can tell, a ranch expansion and nothing more. Which is 110% acceptable. That's not like, you know, like bad or anything. Here, please don't fall in the water. Please don't like, you know, please don't hit an invisible wall. I'm, I'm, it just looked awfully staircase-like. I'm just exploring here, game. Uh, maybe, maybe there'll be a treasure pot up here. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I, I think I'm on an invisible wall. <laughs> I think I'm kind of floating. I think I probably could have flew over here the jetpack versus unlocking the ranch expansion. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm the level with you, but sure sure enough all I see are four little spots and nothing more So you know what we just got a ranch expansion, and I love it, but uh, let's get that rubber ducky Let's uh, let's see here. Are you? The, 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 the toy of choice for puddle slides, and if so What do they what do they do with? I don't- I don't know what they do with toys. Like, is that a- is that a rooster? No. I, for some reason I thought I saw a rooster there. Like, what do they do with toys? Does that make them produce more ports? Does... I mean, I mean, there's no, like, slime happiness that I am aware of other than, like, when they're hungry or... Or, or being feral, but these are obviously not feral, or the- or nor hungry. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> Did he just boop it? They appear to be congregating around it. They are definitely playing with it. <laughs> they are definitely playing with it. Uh, I, I don't know what that is and what it does, but we found ourselves a rubber ducky. And you know what? I'm perfectly 110% A-OK -okay with this. You guys are boom slimes. You'll eat these. <laughs> That's great. You guys just got so much food in here. This is just, just too much food. We clearly need more slimes. You know what? Let's collect some of our plorts here. Go turn them in. Uh, not for money. Not, not these ones. But turn them into the refinery to keep unlocking things. Especially now that we unlock the advanced apiary. And I think I will... Uh, I think I'm going to sleep. Because Casey sent me a new mail. I need to read that. He might even have sent me two since I've last been there. But, uh, yeah, it's also late at night, so let's do that, speed up some time, refresh everything, and then make some visits over to our pumps, which... Actually, no, no, no. I keep calling them pumps, but, they're, but they're generically they're all called extractors. Uh, to the apiaries. The apiaries will be the ones that will be done here shortly. The, well, the one... Two of the drills will also be done soon. The one's an advanced one. So I think I'll pass some time on that one. Just let that sit. Oh, God, I shot... <laughs> I shot water at it. I'm pretty sure that's how you ruin it, me. I'm pretty sure that's how you're ruining it. So I think I have five APRs out there, two novice drills, and one advanced drill. I I kind of want to just unlock. Oh, let's actually go get the blueprint for. Is that 1,500 again? Yes, it is. You know what? Let's let's unlock the advanced advanced apiary. No point in making little normal apiaries anymore. So advanced apiary. Let's see here. 20, 12, and six. So again, pink plorts being the limiting factor. Um. Hmm. <laughs> it's basically to put down what you can afford, essentially. You, you, you kind of just want, like, one of everything. I'm gonna lock the two of them. It's coming down to the pink... It's co it's coming down to the, uh, the pink, uh, plorts. So you know what? Considering I just unlocked the ranch expansion, and there's a lot there, and there's still a lot in the overgrowth that I haven't really worked with, I could put pink slimes over there. Um, what is it? Okay, so it's a tabby, a regular, yes, it's a, a regular tabby. No, they like stony hens. Is there a slime that prefers just generic hens? I don't think so. No, I don't think there's a one that prefers normal ones, because I was thinking of, like, getting double, you know, double from the natural food that they'd be eating over. They'd also be eating the pogo fruit, which if I gave them pogo fruit, that's the favorite of the... It's not the phosphor slimes, right? They're like cute bears. Who likes pogo fruit? Does anybody prefer pogo fruit? I think pogo fruit, just like carrots, is a, a generic. Yeah, so everything that they have access to over there in a free range would not give me double drops. But it would still be free drops. So either way, it's good. I'm just trying to think of like a better way to do it. Anyway, star mail. The van! 
The van, the candy van! Haha, <laughs> I wasn't that bad. You just don't have the fortitude to make it as an artist, I guess, Beatrix Lebeau. Can climb a mountain before breakfast, but can't spend a few days in ahem, <clears throat> modestly accommodated. Breaks, breaks down only half the time. Vintage touring van. You were so miserable, I still laugh about it. But I really did appreciate it for those few days. It was great to have you in the crowd. That van still runs, by the way, from Casey. So nothing overly important from Casey, it doesn't seem like, anyway. Uh, the Rewards Club. I mean, I could get that, but... Oh, no, I need to sleep. I need to sleep. Let's sleep until morning here. I could get that, but in the, uh, the, the money scheme right now, I need to start pinching some pennies. But if I am to do what I'm thinking of doing... <laughs> That's gonna get me every time. <laughs> if I am to do what I think I'm gonna do, then that means we need to scooch the... the chickens out of there. The chickens no longer should be in the overgrowth. Like, like my, um, my specific chickens, the one that I'm growing, not the free range ones, like those are fine, those are specifically there to feed the slime. But I think it'll be a good idea to mix it with a tabby and a pink slime. Because the pink would then eat the pogo fruit. Pink would eat everything, because also there's carrots in there. And we specifically want more pink ports. And there's no graceful way of collecting those ports, that's the one problem that I have. Um, those are just on the ground, remember that? They're, they're just on the ground, they're not in a cage, they're not contained. Hmm. Like, the, the, the idea of free range to me is cool, but then I also feel like, you know, I'm missing out on a lot of the positives from having them corralled. But you know what? It's free stuff nonetheless, and if I can put down a, a full-blown cage and grow more slimes over there, and still keep them protected and have a turret for, uh, like, the water, then I see really no negatives. Like that, I could just use that as further expansion expansion for my range. You get some oak okas. Let's store my carrots and my odd onions. Which, again, um, I just kind of have these odd onions. I haven't really been using them, but I mean, have not, want not. I suppose. I have no clue. <laughs> no clue. When I put pumps down over here, did I put down normal ones? I don't think I put down any extra ones. Let's put down the let's put down the advanced ones before I forget. So advanced pump on day 16. So day 19, that'll be done. Day 19, that'll be done as well. So you guys just stay there and do pump things. Hypno toad. That's close enough, right? <laughs> close enough. Um, I I want your I want your ports, but you know what? They're not gonna go anywhere. Um. The thing I need to do before I mess with the chickens... Oh my god, that, that slime was twitching. The thing I do before I mess with the chickens... I need to make money. I need to be able to go to the... Oh, the docks or whatever that place was called? Put two new coops there. Because I currently have two. And then upgrade them to maximum. And then pretty much just break the, the old ones. I mean, I, I, I guess I have truly no need for them at this point because... Well, with them being there, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> with them being there, they really don't do much. I don't want a slime to jump in there and eat my chickens, you know? I, they would eat everything. They wouldn't stop at one. <laughs> they they don't have that shut off switch in their bellies, you know, to say, or one of their brains say, hey, you stop. No, they, they just keep going until everything's gone. I, I, I gotta be the shut off switch, so I gotta think of ways to uh, make sure they don't do anything that. Uh, I don't want them to do. We know that they're going to do exactly that, as they are slimes. And that is what they do. Exactly that. <laughs> Give me that money, because I'm about to spend it all. Man, I got my monies. Look at the gold. I like how the gold plorts are going down over time, and I've not. I've turned it in one, I think, in the, the entire playthrough. It's. Supply and demand by foot. Apparently, gold is renewable here on the far, far ranch. Make this gives me no incentive to put them there. I hear it has something to do with Gordos, but I have no, no, uh, I have no idea. I've not like looked into it or researched or anything. I think I just saw a comment in passing, and I was like, I don't think I want to read everything because I don't want to be completely spoiled. But you know, it's one of those things like you see, you're like, oh, okay, that's a thing. I need to store the boom ones. Hmm. 
as much as I want to sell those for profit, I kind of need to store the boot parts. I haven't been storing them. Ouch! In my face! I remember one of the things that we just recently unlocked needed boom plorts, and I didn't have very many. So I tell you what, I'm gonna go put the boom plorts away. I think some of the stuff will have fallen. Yeah, this, uh, we'll, we'll harvest this up. Um, what's the what's the plort that I have the least of? Tabby, honey, uh, da, 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 how much phosphor? Oh, okay. So we're putting away, <laughs> putting away phosphor and boom. <laughs> That's a no-brainer. And then we're picking up the mint mangoes and then the cuberries on the way back home. And I'll sell the other ones that are in my inventory. Stands to reason. So now I'll have the ability to uh, work towards some of this once I, of course, get more pink plorts because we all know that the, the name of the game is the, the pink plorts, but uh, we're not there yet. So my, my plan is to go gather up some pink slimes and some tabbies, combine them, and pretty much let them free range. And now I have no idea how well they're going to free range. Like, is that always loaded? Is that always running? Is that area always just updating? Or do I have to visit that regularly to get them to free range? Like, to get them to load into me? Because remember the chi remember the chicken from a few episodes back who went flying? And he stayed flying until I came home. Like, you, you, know, you know what I'm talking about. I'm not making this up. This happened. <laughs> this is, I don't know, free ranging is something I've never done before. So we shall see. However, guys, it is totes my goats. Time to wrap the episode up here. So, what, 14? 14? I think 14 of Slime Rancher. Again, very much hope you guys are enjoying the series as much as I am. It's a lot of, oh, that was a mistake. It's a lot of fun, a nice change of pace. I have a surplus of food and I need more silos. I need to do stuff and things, you guys. So, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.